Hey guys, the Techline here, and here with a video tutorial on how to install Windows 8 Consumer Preview. So let's get started. First of all, you'll need to get the ISO image from Microsoft's website. Uh, here's the link, and be sure all the links are in the description down below. So first of all, get the ISO you need, and for this demonstration I'll be using 32-bit. And just click download, and wait for it to finish. I already have it downloaded, so I can just stop it right <coughs> here and just get the product key just copy in, in case you need it and another thing you'll be needing is the latest version of VirtualBox which you'll need to install it on since you do, if you don't want to replace your Windows copy that you're running right now so to start it up click on new next just type in Windows 8 really don't have to name anything but you see it automatically puts it in there if you have a 64-bit version just click on 64-bit but we're using a 32-bit version so we're just going to put Windows 8 click on next uh, and the minimum amount for 32-bit is 1 gig but since I have an 8 gig machine I'll just give it 3 gigs just to make it smoother around 3 uh, next create a new hard disk uh, VDI dynamically allocated so if you go past the allocated space you've put it uh, it will expand it so next uh, 20 gigs is the minimum requirement we'll act 16 for 32 24 64 next create and just create it now we're going to right click and click on settings go into system and click on processor and click on PAE slash NX and you can change the amount of uh, CPU cores you want to use so for this demonstration I'll just use two um, make sure these are enabled display uh, enable 3D and 2D acceleration and just give it 256 depending on how much you want to give it and last of all you need to go to storage and this is where you'll be adding the ISO file so just click on that and there it is already so I'll click on that and there we go and click on OK and start and OK OK there we go we have a little fish and the 8 you can see this is a bit different from the developer preview see as you can see the new Windows 8 logo uh, choose your preferred language English for this method. Next, and just install now. And setup's gonna start. <clears throat> and this is the product key, the one that we copied before. And oh crap, well, it's not there. Luckily, we have it right here and we can copy it from there. Let's minimize that. Thought you could do copy and paste, but. Fortunately, you cannot. So just put it in there. D N J X J seven X D W eight two three seven eight T X X Two two, oh, did not see it was adding there. Okay, so two three seven eight T X two two T X and B K G. Seven J. Okay, so once you have that added, just click on next. It's gonna verify it. Now we're just gonna read this really fast. There we go. Accept the license terms. Next. And custom. And there is that virtual hard disk you made, so just click on that next. And it's gonna copy the Windows files, and this is the part that takes the longest.
So you can see it's almost on expanding files and it's just finished. It's going to install the features. It's going to install some updates if you're connected to the internet. And then it's going to restart. So we'll just wait for it to do that. And there we are installing updates. Done. And now almost done installing Windows. <laughs> And we're starting in 10 seconds. We don't have that kind of time. Restart now. And OK. Thank you very much. You don't have to type anything right now. And there we go. Colorful fishy again. And yes. OK. Setup is updating registry settings. And. We should be to the setup screen now. Yep, preparing. Getting the devices ready, aka USB. And 3%. Six. Apparently Windows 8. Oh, okay. That was faster than I thought it would happen. Okay, 100%. Getting the system ready. And it's going to restart again. Okay. Don't press anything. And okay. Say hello again for the third time to the fish. Okay. And... Let's wait. Might as well just maximize this. Okay. Again, it's going to prepare. Fade out. Yay. You can see it's using the new Metro theme. So let's give it name, the tech lion. Always remember to put caps. And I'm failing at spelling today. The the tech lion. And let's just make it cool color. There we go, green for Android. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, blue. Next. Uh, let's put some express settings. Email address. I do not want to sign in. Local account. Username. The tech line. Password. Lion. Lion. What comes after the tech tech and finish oh apparently it can't be the same as PC name so we should just add a space hopefully that'll work yes it does so finalizing our settings and Welcome the tech line. Okay, so it's gonna work now. And let's just wait. Preparing Windows. And let's prepare Windows. Let's see how long it takes. 
to prepare windows. And there we go. Windows 8 Consumer Preview looks so much better than Developer Preview. So you can see how you have all your apps and Xbox Live games too. So if you have an Xbox, good for you. You will have full compatibility with your Windows 8 system. Check out our desktop for the original Windows look. Evaluation copy. See, it looks just like that, but better. Internet Explorer, a little fishy there, upside down 8, and there we go, there you have it, Windows 8 installation. Uh, again, thanks for watching, and once again, this is the tech line, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in our next video.